finally made it to Wednesday. So what the hell? Ah, fuck, I need to visit and see what Kit wants for his birthday. I don't... I don't know. I mean, he shows up this early and we're supposed to know? What gives, game? Yeah, you could probably buy one if you really want to do. These things are pretty cheap. Well, we got plenty of money. Let me get rid of this, uh... This damn keg. There we go. That completes our set. Excellent. We didn't even have to make that last one ourselves. That kind of sucks. Come on, chickens. Don't you trust me? Ducks. I need to uh, get a little bit more grass for them. I've got money now, so we're going to be heading into town. So we need to meet with Kent and his peeps. See what the hell he likes. Can't buy guns or anything like that. Fisty. Aw, oh, Fisty. What are you doing? Drop it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dropped it right in the middle of the path. That's fine. It can stay there. That's right. Oh, damn it. Jumbo, really? Nothing? No gumbo, no fanny, no rumpus, no cunsy. Come on. <laughs> Fatso, no? Everybody's really pissed off. Ow! Yes. Excellent. Palm oil. I guess I already tried palm oil. Alright. Okay, so everybody's good on food then. So I don't need to worry about refilling their, uh, their trough until it rains next. But I'm sure I'm going to run into run in there several more times in panic mode, thinking I forgot it. Uh, let's see. No gifts stay down there. Thanks. All right. Garbage, some hot garbage, and some regular garbage. Those are just the regular handout flowers. Yeah, I never even really bothered with the boats. Wait, is there even a boat dealer on there? I'm not sure. I don't remember one anyway, Hal. Uh... Bait. Oh, right, for the SSD. <laughs> That's a pretty big uh, cargo boat. I don't think it's going to be so easy to push. Oh. <laughs> Fatty, fat, fat horse. Oh, Jesus Christ. This No! This is not supposed to happen. Spend all that time clearing your farm <laughs> only to fall asleep, wake up, and everything is in ruins. These trees are still stumps. <laughs> uh, I only just realized we can't even go to Pierre's today. It's Wednesday. Ugh. Should have saved some boo booze for Kent. Come on, horse. Hello, wizard. How are you today? Ah, this is imbued with potent arcane energies. It's very useful for my studies. Thank you. Right. Uh, it takes years of studies. Sure it does. Just speak to everything. Sure like to... Well, that's why you make a lot of money. We hire people you <laughs> to do it.
One day and all hell breaks loose. Indeed. Only he could get Chlamydia hooked up with some roofies. She might be able to get her a date. Hi, Mr. Mayor. You want a flower? Very nice of you. Thanks. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to talk to him, but I'm not clicking fast enough. Ah. Doing his mayoral duties. Like make forcing everybody to pay their property taxes. My goodness. Yes, it is. So, there's still have tons of work to do. Why are you all freaking out? Where's your husband at? God damn it. Get out of the way. Where's Ken? Can't just get to hang out at home? Yeah, I guess he's just hanging out here. I never did read this letter, did I? Oh, yeah, I did. Of course I did. That's Vincent's report card. It's shit. You've been here a while now, haven't you? Your farm must be thriving. It's a doing okay. You want a flower? <laughs> I don't know what you like. Hey, now. That was a really great gift. Thanks. So he just likes those regular flowers. He doesn't love them. I don't know what he loves. No, we won't turn down a flower. Let's go see Clint real quick. Oh, right. Yeah, he was on his way over to Marty's, wasn't he? He most certainly was. Get a penny of flower. Oh, Abigail's in here, too. This looks nice. You look nice too, Penny. In Pelican Town my whole life. Can you believe that? Well, actually, no, I can't believe that, Penny, because your house has fucking wheels on it. You can move it. You just attach a car in it and go. <laughs> what do you mean you haven't lived anywhere else? Uh. Yeah, I guess she does. She still love this. You're the best, Glamidia. Oh boy. Well, Penny, you might be in trouble. Chlamydia might do some clam slamming with uh, Abigail there. Ah, uh, okay. And good old Clint. Let's give him a gold bar. Yes, this is exactly what I've been looking for. Of course it is. And you know what? We also forgot to get... I should have had more Omni... Uh, Omni Geodes. Now you look fine. So, did you need anything? Just want to visit. Apparently we went up a friendship level with Clint, too. Well, obviously. If it's... I, hadn't, I guess I hadn't talked to him since then. So, never mind. Yeah, those trees that I chopped down, they're already sprouting back. I'm probably going to have to go through all those stumps down there. I guess that's what happens when I listen to chat. I get, <laughs> I get fucking rickrolled in my own chat sometimes. Yeah, we still got to stop and see George. And... Ah, fuck, I want to buy some more seed. Obviously, won't be doing that. Um, get those geodes... Go back, see the dwarf. I don't, what the hell did I do with those? Am I still awake? What do you mean? Well, it's easy. If I sleep... If I sleep during the day, then I'm usually up at night. Oh, yeah. And that skeletal tail. Probably drop that off at the museum as well. The dwarf... And um, mm. else? George, I should be able to talk to George pretty late. Let's let's make sure we get this um 
this bone dropped off first. I guess I would have had to come back here anyways. So that doesn't make sense. Never mind. <sighs> Jesus. Alright, Dax. I had the bones with the rest of the bones. We already got a skeleton thing, so... Statue, so... We get a sloth statue. Is it a dancing sloth? I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell what I'm looking at. Yeah, I had to come back here anyways to get the horse, so... <laughs> I just wasted more time coming here. Oh, well. Try, uh... Put a little bit of love in the air. Hey, I really love this stuff. You can find great things in the mines. Yes, you can. Hey, you want to buy something? Maybe. Nope. You don't sell anything I want, dwarf. <laughs> but I want you to send me letters. Telling me how much you love me. Let's go see George. Where's Abigail at now? I think we're up to one. There's still a lot of people we haven't done anything for, really. I'm kind of curious what Krobus is into. Maybe the those dark... These things, too? These void essences? <laughs> Trouble saying that. Let's try giving him that one. Let's see what he says. I already gave him, what, a... Flower, I think. <laughs> well, I don't care to buy anything, but I care to give you something. Okay, that's not really a human taste, Corb Krobus, but... Whatever. Good statue recipe. Still four. Maybe that's what we can do with the diamonds. Four essence, four essence. Oh, he sells them! <sighs> Jesus. You know what? I want that wicked statue recipe. I'm just curious as to what it is. Oh, that, that does look kind of cool, I guess. Oh, and it, it takes coal. Of course it does. Of course it takes coal. Okay, let's find George. Okay, now I definitely don't want to give you anything else. You're obviously, uh, insane. Okay, George. <laughs> I get you, though. I understand you. You're my brother. My favorite thing, thank you. Yeah. It's okay, though, George. I... We can still be friends. Even though grandson, your, your, your grandson is Alex. Jesus. Crave an anchovy. Linus wants an anchovy, and Linus will be thankful. Well, I don't want to make Linus squirt anymore, so I think I'll hold off on that. What time is it? 4:40. Beach. Hmm. It's not raining or anything. So I don't want to... Yeah, I don't think I want to head to the beach. I would most certainly love to go back to the desert, though. By this point, definitely. <sighs> Wish I could have bought some of them dance eats. 
the fruit every other day? Well, I think tomorrow, which I, what I should have already done, is taken all that fruit and thrown it in our kegs. Kind of an awful thing to uh, not do. Let's clear some of this garbage out of the way, because this is frustrating. I can't believe I planted that tree in the wrong spot up there. There's no way I'm going to try to chop at it, because it's just going to kill it. If anybody should kill it, it should be me. And some other... What the hell is this? Some weird looking bushes. I guess because they were all clumped together, they looked really odd. Got some more wild trees growing. I did have a bunch of sprouts down here. They're all going up. So, yeah, we're going to have a decent forest down here again. And lots more lumber. We're not using the area, so why not? Uh, yeah, I want to clear some of this zone out, though. <clears throat> Especially leading down there and off of the map. So I usually ride right, right up and down through this lane. I want to head down towards Marnie's. Took out a tiny tree with a tiny swipe. All right, I'm I'm pleased with that. Some of this other stuff isn't too bad. It's not too close, anyway. This chunk. It will spread over time. <clears throat> I didn't really pay too much attention to how much feed we used during the winter either. I put us about 450, I think. <clears throat> Close to 500. With what animals we have, I think. But I'm not good at math, so. <laughs> Considering buying, if I expand both of our uh, both our barn and our coop, I think I'll I'll want one more silo. Have one for each tier that we go up. And I need another essence for the wizard. some of this other stuff up. <laughs> well, yeah, at least we're getting a decent amount of coal from that. I think I want to build that statue, though. But I spent the money on it. Let's build one. Looks like we got some jam ready outside as well. Something unsettling, unsettling about the looks of this statue. Something for inside of the house, or should we, should we have them protect our crops at night? Put them up there. Oh yeah, another thing we want to do. We're taking this fire pit inside. We're putting this fire pit in the house. That way we can have a little bit of background noise while we... In fact, we might want to do another one. One for the living area. Well, I'm going to buy those lamp posts anyways. That'd probably be a little bit better. Alright, we'll put this stuff back up then. We oh, yeah, had the statue. That statue. cooler in the house or even on the porch that's what I was looking at at first this 
out of the way. You want a bar, buddy? I don't think he's interested. What's the other one look like? Oh, this one I think has to go in the house. We can put the, the sloth up in the kids' room. <laughs> sure, why not? I mean, so. Ah. What are you I guess we could cook up some gold bars if we really wanted. Or we can make some beehives. A beehive. That's about all I can afford with these pieces. Hey, mechanical. And I think it's time to change her hat to back to the flower, considering it's springtime. I think that's a little bit more appropriate. Changed her shirt too recently. You quartz. All right, we're good. Let's get that jam, and then I think we're good for the night. I want to run out there and kill some more grass, or crush some more things. I didn't check the mushrooms, I don't think. <clears throat> I think I might have on the first, but not today. I think we're due for more mushrooms, is what I'm getting at. Oh, it's good for you too, mechanical. <laughs> it's good for me. I need another fire pit out here. Or I can put a couple torches. I don't really have time to do it now. God damn it, I'll try. <laughs> That's pleasant. We'll need one like right there. All right. It's been a good day. Good day. Ah, uh, yeah, that was all my fault. I spent all that time complaining. It was my fault. Well, that's one thing I know I'm definitely doing is keeping the fire pit there. If there's anything else we can get our hands on that makes... I don't know, even like a music box would be cool or a jukebox. Shroom wine? No. I'm pretty sure I've tried. And, uh... To no success. <laughs> 